Parents say it didn't have to happen. 18 students arrested and at least one student hurt in a lunchroom brawl. One of those parents tells CBS2 he warned school officials about high tensions before they erupted. Our Dorothy Tucker has this original report. Looking at a bruise on my eye and then scratches on my face. Bruises Nakira Frazier suffered during a lunchroom brawl at Longwood Charter School. She's the one on the floor. Somebody was stomping me in my face. Frazier says she's a victim of bullying by a group of girls, and she's complained numerous times to school administrators. They keep doing the same thing over and over, bumping me, saying slick stuff, and they said, just deal with it. Well, I'm disgusted. Carter Frazier says he's not the only parent complaining, his daughter not the only complaining student. You got parents coming up twice a week and the same outcome, nothing. But the fight caught everyone's attention. Frazier and 17 other students, mostly girls, were suspended and arrested. Police records show some were charged with battery, others disorderly conduct. The principal had all the kids arrested because she said she tired of dealing with it when she never dealt with the problem in the first place. Frazier is angry his daughter now faces a misdemeanor and is out of school for 10 days. That's 10 days of education that 18 girls won't have, and we still don't have a solution. A spokesperson for Longwood Charter said in a statement, we can assure you that we have taken all appropriate actions to restore order and peace in our school. Sources tell us that some of the students involved in the fight will be expelled. Reporting live from the newsroom, Dorothy Tucker, CBS 2 News. Back to you, Robin. Erica. Dorothy, thank you.